Hey Android fans, this is Eric from HollywoodPhoto.com with another Android app review. And today I'm going to be talking to you about the app Snap Swipe Drawer. Uh, really cool, simple app, very effective at what it does. Basically, you know, your notification panel, that is one of the things that separated Android from iPhone until iPhone decided to copy it because it was such a cool idea. And uh, use your notification panel all the time. So now, what if you had one notification panel that was exactly what it already is, but then another one that you could swipe down and have access to widgets? Well, that's what Snap Swipe Drawer does for you. It allows you to have a second notification panel, but it's not a notification panel, it's a widget panel. It can hold any of the widgets uh, from your apps, which is really, really cool. Now, of course, seeing is what really makes a difference, seeing how it works and how I'm using it on my phone. So let's jump on my phone. I'm gonna show you how it works, how you set it up, and why I think it's a really, really awesome app. Okay, so here we are on my phone, and you're wondering, okay, what is this snap swipe door thing? Well, you know, you drag from the top, you get your notification panel, just like you always do in Android. But what if you could also have something like that for widgets? Well, there you go. As you can see, it's just like a notification panel, except now you're seeing widgets. This is a weather bug weather widget. This is a A plus calendar widget that I have, and you can see full functionality. I can. Uh, drag inside of there. I've got the Conjure app widget which would allow me to quickly search using Conjure. This is a better camera widget so it allows you to not just open the camera but specifically open the camera to the scenario you want like single shot or HDR or panorama and so that's a cool widget that I like to have easy access to and then the Yelp widget for searching on Yelp. So you can see uh, and you swipe up and it's gone and it's available to you inside any app uh, just the way that uh, the notification panel is. So here I am inside the Amazon app. There's my notification panel. But if I drag down from the center, I get quick access to any of these widgets that are part of uh, the uh, snap swipe drawer. So that's how it works. That's what it is. And let's go inside the settings so you can see. Here's where you add your widgets, and I have the Pro version. You can try out the uh, regular version for free, and you can have three widgets. With the Pro version, you can have as many as you want. Uh, you can long press and reorder them. So you can drag and drop and move, put them where you want them to be. Uh, so that's how you move them around. And then you click the plus button, you can add another. And I'll show you, click the plus button, you have access to all the widgets you have on your phone. So all the widgets you have on your phone, you can add to this panel. If you click the menu button, you can go into preferences, and you'll see widgets one finger scroll. So you can set it so that you can uh, scroll inside a widget like I did with my calendar, just using one finger, and then you use the edges in order to scroll through the whole drawer. Uh, if you turn that off, then you would use two fingers to scroll inside the widget, and one finger anywhere would scroll the drawer. Activation areas, you can have left and or center and or right. As you can see, I made it the center um, because I want left and right left open for my regular notification. You can have an active or inactive on the lock screen and active on immersive uh, mode. Now that means that when you're in an app that doesn't show the notification panel, you can have it active uh, even in that case or inactive. I have it inactive because if an app uh, is doesn't show the notification such as my camera app. That's a situation where I'm not going to want to be using that anyway um, And then accessibility service if you enable accessibility, it'll work better um, And that's so apps that use notifications usually do work better and do request that and if you press this It'll just take you into your Android accessibility settings so that you can turn on uh, the accessibility service for the snap swipe drawer and that's pretty much all there is to it those are all your settings and preferences, and uh, like, you could, like you saw, easy access to all of the widgets. You don't need to put them on your home screen anymore. You can have them in this drawer, and you can have access to them anywhere you are, which is just really, to me, a really, really awesome app uh, with a lot, of, uh, a lot of potential. So as you can see, Snap Swipe Drawer is an awesome app. It pretty much eliminates the need to have widgets on your home screen because you can have widgets accessible to you anywhere you are. Whether you're on your home screen or inside another app, 
one quick swipe down and boom, those widgets are available uh, to you with the information you need or with whatever function or feature you want to use of the widget all right there with one quick swipe. So really, really awesome app. I'm gonna have the link in the description below. You can click that link, jump over to Google Play and pick it up for yourself to add to your phone. Anyway, that's it for this review. If you like this review, please click that like button. Know anyone who might be interested in this app, then please share it with them through Google Plus or Twitter, Facebook, all those ways are down there. Jump over to my channel. Check out all the other Android app reviews, over 100 Android apps, and they're all apps like this one. No games, just apps that help make your phone better. So you wanna check those out. I also have a ton of product reviews, uh, smartphone accessories, tablet accessories, um, electronics, gadgets, household appliances, all kinds of cool stuff so check those out as well anyway that is it until next time this is eric reminding you that your android phone is only going to be as good as you make it